Did you know that there are dinosaurs named after Sauron and Thanos from Marvel? Some paleontologists don't miss a chance to give dinosaurs funny and ridiculous names like Gazazaurus or Drinker. What about the name Piesniskizaurus? Yeah, all of those dinosaurs are really called like that. My name is Alex and in this video I'm going to tell you about 9 dinosaurs with the most unusual names. Let's get started. The drinking dinosaur. That's exactly what comes to mind when you hear the name drinker. In fact, the name has nothing to do with alcoholism or thirst. The drinker was a harmless herbivorous dinosaur and it got its name in honor of the famous American paleontologist Edward Drinker. The length of drinker was small, only 2 meters, and he weighed no more than 20 kilograms. His distinguishing feature was its wide legs, which helped it move in swampy terrain. Pietnitskizaurus yeah, you heard it right. Have you ever named a dinosaur after a friend? The name Pietnitskizaurus seems almost unpronounceable for foreign paleontologists. They have their fellow paleontologist Jose Bonaparte to thank for that. He named the new species of dinosaur in honor of his friend, Argentine geologist of Russian origin Alexander Pietnitsky. By the way, a video about the dinosaurs of Russia is going to be released soon on our channel. Subscribe so you don't miss it. Pietnitskizaurus was very similar to Olazaurus, except that scientists still break their tongues when trying to pronounce its name. Pietnitskizaurus. It was a feathered predatory dinosaur that moved on its hind legs. It had well-developed forelimbs, a strong skull, and the long, sharp teeth that helped it hunt. Bambi Raptor Every child has dreamt of finding dinosaur bones at least once, and West Linister was indeed lucky. In 1993, he and his parents were searching for fossils and discovered bones belonging to a previously unknown species. West named his dinosaur after the baby deer Bambi and he got Bambi Raptor. And if Bambi was a sweet and kind animal, then Bambi Raptor is a ferocious predator that would have happily hunted poor Bambi. Interesting fact, paleontologists who examined its bones concluded that the Bambi Raptor could curl its fingers into a ring and the resulting sign was okay, like can you imagine that? Irritator Paleontologists are human too and get tired on the job. Once one of them got so tired that he called a new species of dinosaur an irritator. But the dinosaur itself was not to blame for anything. The paleontologist was angry not at him, but at the private collectors who ruthlessly dug up the skull and almost ruined it, making his job more difficult. Irritator is a relatively small dinosaur, it's 8 meters long and weighs 1 ton. He himself did not annoy anyone and quietly and peacefully fished in the fresh water. He had everything he needed for this. Spear teeth, nostrils pulled back so as not to swallow the water, and huge clothes hooks. Gasasaur. If you don't like your name, imagine how Gasasaur feels. And it's not because of his stomach problems, alright? The fact is that this theropod was discovered by employees of the gas company when conducting landworks. And it was a predator weighing 150 kilograms, which lived on the territory of modern China. At that time, people still knew nothing about dinosaurs, so they took his bones for the remains of a dragon and made medicine from them. Yeah, like some people did in Pacific Rim, right? Ulugbegzorus uzbekistanensis. Ulugbegzorus uzbekistanensis, named after Tamerlane's grandson. It was discovered on the territory of modern Uzbekistan and was the most fearsome predator that lived in this territory. Uzbekistanis was 8 meters long and weighed about a ton. Yeah, with such a constitution, no one would ever tease that dinosaur because of its name. Dinochirus. Imagine a duck 11 meters long and weighing 12 tons. This is Dinochirus. It had no teeth whatsoever and was an omnivore. The name Dinochirus means terrible arm. Its forelimbs were indeed large and crawled and were needed to catch fish. The Dinochirus had a huge crest on its back and it looked like this. Yeah, that's one of the duck that I definitely wouldn't get near to. Soraniops. Lord of the Rings fans are everywhere, and paleontology is no exception. In 2007, a new species of dinosaur was discovered in Morocco and named after Sauron. Sauroniops. 
According to the paleontologist who named the find when he looked at fossilized piece of skull with an eye socket, he remembered the eye of Sauron from The Lord of the Rings. From other dinosaurs, Sauron Yops was distinguished by a massive crest on its head, and with its size and body structure it resembled a T-Rex. Sauron Yops was a predator and grew up to 9 meters. Can anyone ever name something cute after Sauron, please? Thanos. While fans were upset about Tony Stark's demise in the Avengers finale, Raphael Delcourt and Fabiana Lori described a new species of dinosaur they named Thanos. Despite being named after a powerful titan, the dinosaur itself was quite small but predatory. Thanos lived on the territory of modern Brazil and shared the territory with another predatory dinosaur, the remains of which have not yet been reconstructed. Maybe this one turned out to dust after Thanos' snap? We can make each of these dinosaurs for your park in any color and size. You can find out all the details at the link in the description. Comment what you would name your dinosaur and see you soon!